This is a stretch. I finally boarded. I thought I was going to be able to make it, but I'm here. Uh, I'm um, boarding Qatar Airways and this is heading off to Doha in Qatar. I want the last seat. I look back there. Finally, I'm boarded. So I thought I was going to be able to make it. There was a shop of block traffic, but in the, the check-in counter, uh, it's weird here in Qatar you can uh, do an online check-in, but they want to give you the boarding pass. This year I have to get into it. Anyway, so I made it to in the Qatar airplace. I am flying to Doha, and then I'm to Johannesburg. And then to Eswatini, and then uh, and then uh, no, all right, done. all right. I feel in uh, Doha in Qatar. I'm heading off to the passport control. Uh, I've been to Qatar multiple times connecting. So first time, this is the first time that I am leaving the airport and exploring Doha. Yes, uh, took a quite a long time journey. It's 15 hours from San Francisco, and I'm the fastest. <laughs> That's why my voice is uh, quite weak, but I'm all right. So here we go. So I'll be heading off to the uh, passport control. Here we go. All right, so it's seven here. Got our time. So I'm right here. Uh, waiting for the taxi. It's pretty organized. I got my SIM card already. Yeah, she's really hot. It's a 7 uh, p.m. here in uh, Qatar town. Uh, Arrive safely, flight is safely. I'm right here in uh, Doha in uh, Qatar. Been to Qatar multiple times, but first time to get out and see Doha.
It was a smooth ride. Got his uh, hotel, the Castle Premium Hotel, and it saw there is a store at the corner. It was a smooth taxi ride. Here, so you can use Apple Pay on the taxi. You can pay cash, um, you can get a credit card. Apple Pay is good, and I got my SIM card already. It's what? Well. It is a scorching hot. It's uh, about half past seven or almost eight here at Dollar Time. And uh, we are, Doha is uh, 10 hours ahead of California. So uh, here is uh, piping hot still, 113 today according to the forecast for today. And then today, right now is 100, uh, 100 so degrees fire. Hi, travel line, I get two luggages. Came from, uh, of course, uh, San Francisco. And this is uh, Doha. And uh, tomorrow I'll explore Doha capital city of Qatar. I've been to Qatar multiple times but first time to get out of the terminal. So because Qatar is like hop going to Europe or going to Africa. Right after Qatar I am flying off to South Africa as uh, as well as uh, uh, Malawi. Bye for now. I am checking in at the premium Casa Hotel. So just check in here in hotel here in Doha. Um, it was uh, very smooth uh, travel, very smooth immigration, uh, but it's quite a bit chock a block. A lot of uh, arrivals today, and it took me about maybe 30 to 35 minutes uh, waiting for my turn to get queued up, uh, as well as to go through the local organs for maladies. It's uh, pretty easy. To show your passport and that's it we even ask for my accommodation uh, it's great for us to worry right anyway so right here i am uh, here in my hotel room it's a high bit too high it's a pretty massive side effect and there is a sofa and a lounge and a tiny and i don't need to go in the room 
Our babies have caught this. What I need, water, complimentary, even had, give me an extra water. Uh, that's what I need this time. Uh, water is my favorite. I'm in my fasting state. I've been fasting for almost, uh, well, I think about uh, over 40 hours now. And uh, my last meal was uh, on Monday at 6 p.m. And today it is uh, Wednesday at almost 8 in the evening here in uh, Qatar. Um, this country is 10 hours ahead compared to California. It's, uh, let's say it's half past 8. It is uh, minus 10. Uh, uh, we are ahead. So that's still morning in California. So it has a massive door. And let's take a look at the mm -hmm. There you go. And here you are. Here's the rest. Pretty good. And I'm uh, impressed. Adora. I've been to Qatar multiple times, uh, but this is the first time I'm exploring Goha. All the times because uh, my up in when I travel, like for example, the last time I was in Qatar, I was in the terminal, and I went to Kazakhstan to Qatar Airways and heading up to Africa, even Seychelles, you know, that part of the African continent. So you have to fly uh, from San Francisco to Doha. And this time, I'll be there for uh, six days. And uh, sorry for my voice, like what I said, I'm in my fasted state. Um, I'm trying to get 48 hours. Um, yeah, this is my beverage is watching. Anyway, so, uh, this is my summer uh, travel, and uh, quite late, but that's alright. Oh, they even have a point scale, right? Pretty good. So, uh, yeah, there is a slow fashion point scale. Carry myself every two days. So, right now, I'm here, as like what I said, I am here for six days. Exploring Doha and nearby cities of Qatar, and I know the, uh, the transportation is, is pretty easy. So here we go, let's open the <laughs> window. Okay, let's cut out of here. Oh my god, that is scorching hot. That's the outside. I can feel heat. I checked uh, the, the weather today, it's 113 today. That was the, uh, the hottest. Um, I'm used to heat anyway, so I live in Las Banas in Merced. Um, the hottest we got was 115 almost three years ago, um, but doesn't stay constant. The maximum I had was 105 before I left, so today it was 131. I love the heat anyway, but this is 130. <sighs> I don't know how to respond to this, but I'll be fine. Anyway, so right after, um, um, sorry, mm -hmm. I'm not good. Um, upon leaving Qatar, I'm here for six days, like what I said, I'm flying to South Africa, and then uh, staying in South Africa for a few days, and then go on as a bird, and then flying to as as Watini. As Watini is one of the um, semi Lachlan country which is bordered with, I believe it, um, Mozambique uh, in the eastern part of, southeastern part of Africa of course, to close to uh, Stuanesburg, that's where I'm coming from I will be there for, for several days and then back to Johannesburg and then uh, flying to uh, Malawi which is uh, on the northeastern part uh, I think it's uh, close to Mozambique as well. I'm not sure if they are uh, bordering with uh, Mozambique. Maybe. Just check the Google map. And then I am back to South Africa. Uh, yeah, so I'll be spending some few days in South Africa in Johannesburg before I fly back to Doha in Qatar right here. And then it's something else. All right. So this is, uh, I just need to do the rest of right now. I'm so knackered. I had, um, I took a snooze. I was able to sleep in the plane, uh, intermittently. 
And you know, when I'm when fasting, I feel sleepy. I'm glad I was fasting so I'm get, I get to sleep on the plane. So uh, it's, uh, it's just a uh, time where, you know, each time I fast, I feel sleepy. I have some energy, but not a whole lot. I don't do a lot of things. Spend his work like for example the last few days I was home in Afghanistan I'm doing a lot of uh, cleaning, uh, fix the fence of the chicken of my mom. Uh, yeah, quiet manual, fix my uh, my travel trailer. Took me uh, two hours just to cover and uncover. Need to protect from the elements. And fasting is great. <laughs> it makes me sleep. Alright, so once again, oh, welcome to Doha, you're in Qatar, and like what I said, traveling is not arriving from your destination, it is a looking at the world from a different perspective. Put a smile, and the world will smile at you. Cheers, be safe, bye, and God bless. I need to sleep well.